How long can you run in clomiphene? Could you run it forever? So in clomiphene is not suppressive of endogenous testosterone production. It does the opposite. And based on the clomiphene study, so clomiphene is the combination of n-clomiphene plus zooclomiphene, but the n-clomiphene is responsible for the testosterone boosting effects that we're interested in. In these studies, clomiphene, therefore we can assume n-clomiphene essentially retains its effectiveness for up to three years, almost certainly longer if there were simply longer studies. Because of this, the only reason why it would be necessary to come off in clomiphene is to avoid side effects. Now, usually relative to other PEDs, the enclomiphene side effects are much more conspicuous. So enclomiphene, it isn't going to slowly and covertly destroy your organs. You're almost always going to notice the side effects. The side effects are usually related to estrogen imbalance. You know, too high estrogen or too low estrogenic activity in the brain are possible. Remember, enclomiphene is an estrogen antagonist in the hypothalamus. And, you know, the first thing that usually happens is you get moody or brain foggy. So personally, you know, if I feel great, I don't really consider it necessary to cycle off in clomiphene, but because I am extremely health conscious, often to the point of paranoia, I do like to take breaks every now and then, maybe a month off or so every six months, something like that. Just to really test out if for some reason I didn't notice the mood side effects on in clomiphene and somehow I, I felt better off of in clomiphene. Now, that never happened. I always feel better on in clomiphene because my testosterone is higher. But, you know, of course, the lower the dosage and the less time you're on it, the lower the probability of side effects are going to be. So for all your supplement needs, that information you are looking for is in the Natty Plus cheat sheet in the description below. Peace.